Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the Grinch makeup look. I'm so excited. I've never done it before, but how cute are these? Do you think I could wear them on a dog walk? Probably it's not. But yeah, so let's get going. So to begin with, I'm using my Wellida Skin Food Moisturiser. It is super important to moisturise your skin before putting any product on. And now I'm taking my Electric Cake Liner in Green by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I'm putting it all over the face and down the neck. So to blend this out, I'm just using a buffer brush by Real Technique. Now I am taking the black eyeshadow from my Made by Mitchell Feet on the Ground palette and I'm drawing on the lines and creases on the Grinch's face. You will notice that I am going to pull the most horrendous faces but it really helps if you screw your face up and try create natural lines on your face so you can just follow them. So I do apologise about the horrendous facials that you are going to see. <laughs> horrendous face one. <laughs> Oh wow, they're getting worse. <laughs> Is anyone else obsessed with watching The Grinch? I mean, it's November and I probably started watching it at the end of October. <laughs> So here I'm just drawing out his little button nose, which is surprisingly quite cute for the Grinch. So I'm just shading around the edges and then in a bit I am going to go in with a dark green. So now I'm going to blend the dark green into the black line, just one side of the line. So this is going to make it look more 3D and it just creates more shading. I would say the shading is the longest part, but it is also the most important part of this look. So you guys will see me smiling a little bit, like now. <laughs> this is just to help guide me. So if you're already blended out and ready for the next step, you can skip forward to 5 minutes and 15 seconds.
So now I'm blending the dark green over the eyelids to darken them and later on I add a little bit of black to them. And of course I'm going to repeat this on the other eyes. So if you're happy with where we're at, please feel free to skip to 6 minutes and 49 seconds as all I'm going to be doing is blending out the rest of the wrinkles. Here I'm using the black eyeshadow to create the line going under his nose to his lip. Now I'm taking my ABH liquid eyeliner to create the large pores that he has on his upper lip, which by the way, why are they so big? <laughs> and then I'm also using the eyeliner to create his eyebrows. I'm making them look super long and bushy, as we all know they are. And to do this, I'm just flicking the eyeliner upwards. So I've quickly just gone back to my upper lip, I forgot to put the dark green on it so all I'm doing is just blending it across the top lip and then later on I will pop the pink on the bottom lip. So like I mentioned before I'm just taking the black and I'm just blending it on the top of my eyelashes just to make the eye look ever so slightly darker. And then with my black pencil, I'm going over my waterline, so the bottom and the top. This is going to make the eyes look a lot smaller and darker. I am so sorry if you're funny with eyeballs, even this is making me cringe. Oh. And now for the lashes, because for some reason the Grinch has the longest lashes in the world. So I'm using my Huda Beauty hoodie eyelashes and I'm just sticking them on with duo glue. And then lastly, moving on to the bottom lip. So I'm taking my MAC Talking Points lip liner and I'm just putting it all across the bottom lip. And there you go guys, we are just about done. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you liked the look. If you did then please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys on my next video. Mwah!